just finishing threading up the last of these chilies. Um, physiotherapy yesterday, so thought I'd take it easy today and uh, maybe do a little scrofito, um, which I'll talk you through. Um, so I think it'll work well on one of the teapots I've done. So um, here we'll have a crack on that. Now the chilies. I suppose it sounds very fancy saying graffito um, but all it means is scratch in Italian so um, it's not exactly an advanced technique but you can see what happens with the white slip over the top of the clay and obviously you can scratch through and reveal the clay underneath the slip um, you have to be fairly firm when you're doing this um, what I'm using is just a little thin piece of um, dowling that I've sharpened with a pencil sharpener um, which works very well um, I've tried pins and big needles and various other things but um, that they have a tendency to flake off big chunks of the slip as you're doing it whereas these because the end of it is quite soft it seems to work quite well um, so yeah press quite firmly don't push down too hard on the clay or else you'll uh, break your pot. So. Yeah. so after I've got the uh, first sort of main idea that then I lightly scratch all over the surface to lay out the rest of the pattern. Here we are. a reasonable way through it now. And uh, here we are just finishing off. The uh, spiral pattern that I'm using here, the, or the wall pattern, whatever you want to call it, um, it's very ancient. Um, tens of thousands of years old. It's obviously one of those things that uh, stays in the consciousness sort of thing down the years. So. But it works really well. I like it a lot. There you go. 